I'll be back for another episode of Master Ben Play the Crumbled. In this episode, we'll be continuing on a journey in the World Cup. We have made it to the knockout stages, but first, I need to pick my team that I'm going to be moving to at the end of this tournament. I made the decision like halfway through the season that I was definitely going to move. And I've actually now got more choices than what I thought. Originally, I only had seven, but I'm now up to ten. Could go to Leverkusen, but I don't really want to go to another team in the same league. Could go to Juventus in Sevilla. Not really the main league that I want to be going to. I just eight percent more than what you asked. Could go to Man City, ten percent more than what you asked. Could go to Real Madrid. I could get thirty four percent more than what I asked. Like Real Madrid's the main choice, I think. PSG sixty percent more. Chelsea ninety one percent more. You got ninety one percent more to go to Chelsea. Yeah, but but not going here at all. Like no Spurs eighty two percent more. Could go Arsenal. Okay, the Premier League is definitely what me this season. So I don't actually know which team I'd want to go to because I don't know who's got Champions League football next season in the Premier League. I wasn't really considering it. Or could go to Wolfsburg for seventy k. Yeah, no, and also in the same league, so that's not happening. I have had my mindset on Real Madrid for this season and then go to Premier League this season after. Although the Premier League definitely seems interested in me right now. I think I probably will be playing at least two more seasons in this series. I want to play at least one season in the Liga and I think I'm going to go to Real Madrid for a change because I've done Barcelona a couple of series beforehand. Not in this game, but I've done Barcelona a few series beforehand. So I think going to Real Madrid for a change would be a good. And you know what? We're going to do it. We're going to Real Madrid. Hold to sign. Alright, it's official, we have moved to Real Madrid, but first we are still in international duty. It's time to see who we will be playing up against in the next round in the World Cup. Okay, Romania is not the team I suspected us to play against. If you didn't see the last episode, be sure to go watch it. You already know we're into the round of 16. But there are some interesting results, that's for sure. Portugal and Argentina were both in our group and they have both made it through. Could I end up playing against them again at some point if we beat Romania, which in theory, if we beat Argentina and Portugal, we should. Okay, let's jump into the first game of the episode. Round 16 in the World Cup. Playing against Romania. Let's get a win. Come back. Oh, there's a ball. Is he onside done? He takes a time to get a shot off. Number 8 is going to get the rebound shot off. And as soon as they get from Mozo onside. Okay, it's 1 0. Under three minutes, number eight with the goal, Morgan. Does he not used to be number ten? It's a good start to the game. Usherman passes it forward to number ten, gets a shot off. He took his time to get the shot off. He should have had it off earlier. But luckily for us, the bounce that shift falls perfectly towards one of our players, Morgan, to hit it in back post. Usherman picks it up for Morgan, plays it through to number ten. He turns the play up, back heels it across. Morgan, back post. He cuts it in. Ashburn take the touch, get this shot off, and he slots it in. He was very close to saving that, but he doesn't. It's 2 0, 31 minutes in. Morgan pass it in, touch the brain, he manages to turn, take the touch forward into the space, get the shot off near post. Just in time before the defender comes and blocks it, keep up, it's very close to saving it. Ashburn takes it past one player, it's going to run forward. Can he stay in front? He's going to keep going to the left, to stay in front of him, get a shot off Grosko. Wow, why did he not shoot with his left foot? Why did he shoot with his right foot like that? Gets another chance, takes a pass to player, sends him, gets a shot off far post. It's 3 now. He doesn't mess up this one. It's 39 minutes in, 3 now. By the looks of it, we're going through to the next round of the World Cup. Who would have thought it? Robertson cuts it in. Usherman turns the player, gets a shot off near post, and it's 
And yes, I've buzzed my chance, I may have actually missed it. But then it's 4 0. And injury time. So far, we may have only had one shot off. It was right at the start of the first half, at an impossible angle to score from. Most we've managed to get a total of six shots off. However, we may have actually had more possession. But it's very close. Was it through? Oh, that's not the ball I wanted. I want to make it a chance for another goal. Oh, ref. Okay, I'll take the penalty. Can I score a penalty for Scotland? I can. Top right. Easily done. Let's keep hold of it. Get past the player. Go. 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 Wait, wait why did he take that touch to lift? I didn't change the angle that I was running to. When it comes in, he punches it out. McGregor's going to get his edge of the box. Number 10. So it's a through touch of Ben. Across goal. That's a tight angle, but he makes it work. I don't know how I managed to squeeze that in. It's 6 0. It's a pass. He gets the ball from number 10. Spencer player gets his shot off. Barpo at a tight angle. Outside the boot, comes in. Got another chance, but I'm going to try to pass it across. Okay, he scored it. I've got an assist. But what the hell is that? He just has to tap it in. Why did he try to take a touch and then almost lose it? Two yards out when there's literally no one in front of him. Got a pass it across. It makes it to him and then he takes a touch and then goes for a test of power when he's right there. Oh, the defensive player wide open. But thankfully, the keeper makes it safe. It's not actually had anything to do this game so far. Well, he had one shot in the first half. But it was off target, so. Throw to Master goes. It's a 7 0 win. What a surprise, Archie Brown gets to play the match. Once again, getting another perfect 10 rating with 5 goals, 1 assist, 12 shots, 11 being on target. End of the game, Romania only managed to get 2 shots off. Whereas Scotland managed to get a total of 18. And we did get our possession up quite a bit as well. Moving on to the second game of the video and the quarter final for the World Cup, we are playing against Argentina. We played against them in our group and we did win, to be fair, so there's hope. Maybe Argentina will have another bad game and we can get another win. Let's keep a hold of it, pass it in. Will they get a shot off? It does keep us saves it, is it if I call enough? That's about. Gets a shot off. Oh, I keep I got there. I've got in the ball. Finds Ferguson. Finds Robertson. Robertson's on the left. Goes to a cross back post. Finds him. He's going to get a shot off and it's in. But it's 1 0 against Argentina. 41st minute. I wasn't involved in the goal, but that's fine. It's a good cross from Robertson to be over to number 32 at back post. Good touch. Takes the time of the shot. Finds the space between the players to get the shot through. The defence and pass the keeper back post. I have to muster goals. So we've kind of got one 0 lead against Argentina. We have been getting a lot of chances. To be fair, Argentina have been getting forward a few times. I think they've only had one or two shots taken though. We've had plenty of chances. We've had a few shots. We need to score another goal to to secure the lead. So far, we've had a total of eight shots. Argentina have only had one. Let's get another goal or two, please, please. There's no one in the box I'm going to cross it into. I pass it in now. I get it back. That's the wrong player. I'm supposed to go back to number 10. Oh, no, that was for me to tackle. It wasn't an awful shot, but it was for me to tackle, not shoot. I just went fence space. He's going to run forward. Stay in front. Stay in front. Stay in front. Get the shot off. Up. Why is that so weak? Why is it so close to the keeper? That was supposed to be right at that post. Ashman wins the header and it's threatening to the keeper's hands. No, no, please don't let him score from this. Please, keeper saves it. Okay, just run. Just run. Keep it away from our box. We've got the one the lead. If I can get a second, I'll go for it. Cut back. Did, did he miss the ball completely? You know what? It's fine. McGregor's got the goal, man. It's 2 0. We've secured it. 87th minute. Very much 88. Surely we're through. McGregor takes the touch. Okay, I take a touch forward, a couple of steps, gets it in right for the shot, near post, fires it in. Here we go, the full team muscle goes. We are through to the semi final in the World Cup of Scotland. Who would have thought? 
I would. I was going to be very happy if you even made it out of the group stage. I was going to be very happy if you won a game in the group stage that we had. I should bring us an 8.3 rating with 4 shots on target. Game against Denmark, but okay, we could have won it. I think Denmark could still have a better chance. Against Portugal and Argentina, I thought we had no chance making it in the group stage. And then that game, Scott managed to get a total of 12 shots off, whereas Argentina only got 2. Okay, it is time for the semi-final in the World Cup. We are playing against England. Could this be the toughest team we've came against yet? I kind of would have thought Argentina would have been that team, but we've played them twice and beaten them twice. If we make it, if we beat England, we will be playing against Spain in the final. First off, let's get this win against England. It takes five years to turn around there. As soon as he got the ball, turns to change direction. Please no. He saves it. Please get her. Oh, that goes all the way to Ashley Brown. Naples shot! Ah, oh, Kiel saves it. After muscle goals, it's nothing each. It's definitely a close game. We're getting forward. We're getting chances. We just don't get the best chances off. Oh, but we're wasting them by having an awful shot. So far, we've had a total of four shots. They've had two. Possession is very even. It's like the 50 each. It's a close game. Stones puts a slight tackle one. Is that a straight red? It is a straight red. It's going to make a big difference in this result. Hopefully that helps us out quite a bit. Okay, they've taken a forward off to bring on another defender. Trying to pass it to Saka. Bellingham. Bellingham. Shut him down. Shut him down. He gets a shot off. It's over, thankfully. I should mean first time. Oh, it wasn't first time. Bob put it into the box. Bellingham went for the scissor finish. I don't know if it's the sign anything or the keeper saved it. Best goal kick. Yeah, I just hit the sign in. Thankfully, that was wide. Ashburn, Ashburn picks up the ball. Pass it across. Come on, get a shot off. Yes. 37 minutes in. Who scored it? What number is that? Is that 33, 33 of the goal? Ashburn picks up the ball, runs forward into the space, waits for the defender to leave the player. Pass it across into him. He gets the touch, gets the shot off our post. It's number 33 of the goal. Pass it across. Oh, go on, go on, get a shot off. Yes, it's 2 0. 82nd minute, Asher Brown gets his second assist. Anderson gets his second goal. Is that, was he a sub? I saw that as a great substitute and a great formation change. As it stands, we're going through to the final of the World Cup. Do not let him score. Do not let him score. We're going to get a shot off. Kiev saves it. Set for a corner. Play it forward. Number 22. Play that across to Asher Brown. Turn in. Done okay, Go on, get a shot off. There we go. I get my goal in the semi final. It's 3 0. It was a good run for a pack, taking it past two defenders. Get into the box, get a shot off, bad post. Field 10 whistle goals, but into the final. We're playing against Spain. That would probably just be just as difficult as this game was. To be fair, the red card helped us out quite a lot in the end. It was still very even, but. Right after they got the red card. But then once we had scored, they got a bit easier. Ashman gets a perfect 10 rating once again. One goal, two assists, three shot, four shots on target. In the end, Scott managed to get a total of nine shots off as England got five. I can't believe it made it into the final. Normally only play three games per episode, but since it's the final, I've got to include it with the rest of the games that I've played. I can't even put the final in a separate video. So I'm going to join into this one. Scotland versus Spain. World Cup final. Let's see how it goes. Can we... Can we lift the trophy? It's a ball played through to Archie Brown's going to run through. Can I get a goal? Going to shoot far post. Under three minutes before we got a 1 0 lead. What is going on? It's good pass to Archie Brown. He just runs into the box, gets a shot off far post. To give us a 1 0 lead, three minutes in. Okay, apparently I wasn't aiming but I was wanting to go. Oh, there we go, that's a good chance. It's a good tackle, good pass to Archie Brown. He took so long to get that shot off there. It's a like well time pass to Archie Brown. There's nobody in the box to help me there. Find him. Ah. Take a shot from distance, Kiva makes a save. It's been edge of the box, they're going to get shot off, Kiva makes another save. You kind of get into the box to get the shots off, so 
They're taking the shots from outside the box. It's been running through, they're going to get a start to a shot and they fluffed that. Right, okay, the half the muscle goes, they've kind of got one no lead. We scored very quick into the first half. We've had a few chances since Spain's had a few chances. Spain have had five shots off, we've only had four. We've had more possession. Didn't really feel like it towards the end. Well played then. That's a good ball, Ferguson going to get a shot off. Oh, I forget to say, you give up that. That's a good ball forward, they're going to get their pass across, they're going to get a chance for a shot, he wants to save. Rebound, off the post, it's still on. They've got it inside the box, outside. Well, they go for a shot from here, it's blocked. That was a very good chance for Spain, but now we can get a counter attack going. Stay in front, stay in front, stay in front. Yes. Now. Why did he slide? Why did. What? I don't know why he done that. Okay. I may be able to get a touch towards goal a wee bit there. One time finds Archie Brown. It's a good run, get a shot off cross goal. There we go, there's the second goal. 74 minutes in. It's 2 0, Archie Brown with the second goal of the game. Archie Brown plays it to Ferguson. Plays it away to Robertson. Nope. Other field two must have goals. Special. We win the World Cup. After a season of being so unlucky with Boris Dortmund in the Champions League. In the Bundesliga and the German League Cup. All the luck has come through. 12 games of Scotland for the World Cup. We beat Portugal. We beat Argentina twice. We beat England. We beat Spain. We also beat Denmark. We beat Romania, but that was that was definitely our easiest opponent. That's a great angle, thank you, game. I swear this game glitches out and doesn't let it show me there. Um, I've got to be joking. You've got to be joking. We win the World Cup and it's not even going to show me the animation. Well, that's something at least. At least I've seen this one. Our champions. <laughs> McGregor, was, McGregor was the captain, so you got to lift the trophy. And there we have it, we are champions of the world. Definitely the underdogs of the tournament. We did that game with a 9.8 rating, of two goals, six shots, six shots being a target. Oh, it does end up still being a close game the field way through. It's been getting nine shots off, we get eight. I can't believe I actually managed to win it. I was not expecting to even get out of the group stage, never mind win the full competition. This would probably be the only international tournament we're actually playing as well. Alright, well we're going to end off the video here next time. We will be jumping into action with Real Madrid for pre-season. Until then, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you tomorrow for another video. See ya.